Hey everyone, I'm Michael and this is Happy English. For today's English lesson, we're going to take a look at natural English pronunciation, especially American English. A lot of English learners have trouble sometimes understanding native speakers, especially Americans. And I think one reason is because when we speak, we tend to squeeze the sounds of the words together and sometimes we even change the pronunciation of certain words. So for today's English lesson, we're going to look at the pronunciation the natural pronunciation of I am, our, and you. Let's check it out. In spoken English, we like to have the flow of air continuous as we speak. We don't want to have any stops in the sound. A good example of this is the article a uh, and an. So, I can say, I have a pen, I have a pen, a pen. But apple, I have a apple, I have a apple. That's really difficult to say. That's why we change the article to an. I have an apple, I have an apple. Saying an apple is much smoother than saying a apple. And so I think that's how the word an became a word. Well, in other cases, the pronunciation is not necessarily a word, but it's just the style and the sound of our spoken English. Let's take a look at the first one, which is I am. Usually, native English speakers pronounced I am as um. You can say things like, I'm ready, I'm tired, I'm happy, I'm excited, I'm ready, I'm tired, I'm happy, I'm excited, I'm ready for the weekend. Yeah, I don't know about you, but I'm ready for the weekend. Hey, are you going to Jack's party tomorrow? I'm going to go. I'm going to go to Jack's party tomorrow. You know, Jack's having a party. I'm going to go. Are you going to go? I'm thinking about moving to Miami. Yeah, you know, the winter is coming. I hate the winter. I don't know. I'm thinking of moving to Miami. I'm thinking of moving to Miami. Yeah, I'm thinking of doing it. Next is our. Our. Generally, our is pronounced R. And we often try to connect the R sound with the next word. You can say things like our office, our friends, our house. Our office, our friends, our house. Our friends from Toronto are coming to visit this weekend. Oh, I'm so excited. Our friends from Toronto are going to visit. If you want to visit Happy English, our office is very close to Grand Central Station. Yes, that's right. Our office is located on the corner of Madison Avenue and 40th Street. We just moved and our new house is much bigger than the old house. Yeah, our new house is so much bigger than the old house. Finally, we have you. You is generally pronounced as ya. Ya, ya, ya. You can say things like, you like it? You ready to go? You want to go? You like it? Hey, Jack, are you ready to go? I think it's time. Are you ready to go or not? Are you ready to go? I think we're going to be late. Do you want to go to the park? I don't know. Do you want to go to the park? Ah, it's a nice day. Do you want to go to the park? I got a new shirt. Do you like it? Yeah, it's new. Do you like it? No, I just got it. Do you like it? How about you? What did you think of this video? Do you like it? Why not leave a comment below and let us know? Hey, thanks for studying today, and I'll see you next time right here at Happy English. <laughs>